Mark, in a big personal milestone this morning, actually. It's been 10 years since I was pretty badly injured in a horse riding accident during a charity challenge. First time I'd been in a horse. Never thought I'd go near one again, to be honest, but this month I finally, with a lot of help, felt ready to try. After my accident, I received life-saving care at St George's Hospital in London, and it's thanks to the amazing staff who treated me that I'm still here today. For the NHS's 70th anniversary, I got a chance to return to say a big thank you. And as part of our You Care, We Care campaign, we helped to create a wellness garden on site. Time does heal, but the scars remain. And 10 years on, I still haven't been able to go near a horse. However, with some help and guidance from my friend, 14 times Paralympic gold medalist, Sir Lee Pearson, I'm ready to try. So Lee, as you know, I had this accident and ever since I've really not had any sort of experience with, with horses. That unfortunate, terrible accident uh, is, is enough to put anybody off. Yeah. It was very traumatic, it's it totally really understandable. Cool. I'm very proud that you're here and willing just to be on a farm with the horses <laughs> and, and, and hopefully say, maybe we'll, we'll sit you on Xeon and see how you feel. You couldn't be on a better horse, and yeah, hopefully couldn't have a better friend stroke instructor just uh, getting you through this. I obviously trust you implicitly, but I've got to get over that. You can't have that yeah. fear. You, you have to yeah. confront it sometimes and, and, and get over it. Well, I'll so, tell you what, we'll let's try. go to the stables and, okay. and meet your, your new buddy. Okay. I do understand the fear. I'm probably have a degree of fear every day that I ride because they are three quarters of a ton of of, uh, of horse and, and I still every day think it's amazing that they allow me to sit on their backs. So here is my Rio dancing partner. So he flew to South America. Oh, wow. And this is Zeon and little Caitlin behind and this is how friendly he is. Oh gosh, yes, beautiful. Hello. Just put your hand out. Yeah. Here, put your hand out. And he'll just sniff him. I've met Zion and beautiful, beautiful horse. Feeling a wee bit anxious, but not as bad as I thought it would be. But I think that's because I've got Sir Lee beside me. Um, and he's given me a lot of confidence and I, and I obviously trust him completely. This is a massive step forward, just actually standing here so close as I haven't done that for 10 years. And yeah. that he is, is a little bit big, but I know that he's 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 still a very calm, right. beautifully well-behaved horse. OK, that's OK. Keep breathing. Keep that's OK. It's OK. It's OK. I'm just not sure if I can go on, though. I'm, I'll, I'll try, but I'm, I'm not as anxious as I thought it would be, but I still feel a little bit uncomfortable, so we'll just see what happens. Is this your hat? That is That's my hat. championship hat. So that mm. went to the um, Tokyo Games. Of course. If you step up okay. and literally just feel, see how you feel up at that height. Okay. So you're going to put your <laughs> left leg in there. I can do this. Oh. That's fine. Right. He's okay. blowing his nose. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Got, I want to do it and my body's not letting me. <laughs> Dick, well, do you know what I mean? Really, I really just, do. Just stop a minute then. Okay. Just stop. Right. Don't rush. We actually went at her speed, but just encouraged her all the way, kind of giving her kind of a, a very whirlwind of horsemanship, kind of how he was reacting or not reacting really, and how calm and relaxed Zeon was, um, despite Lorraine being understandably yeah, very upset and emotional really. Let go down now. Okay, okay, okay. And then okay. let your leg go forward. Hello. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness me. You ama that's amazing. That is that is actually I never thought I would not in a million years, never thought I would do this. Goodness me. You're gonna have me crying in No, a don't <laughs> Yeah. Sometimes when we're looking at the horses and zoning in, we're thinking too much. So what I want you to do now is rotate your shoulder. Look at me. Right. Just do this a little bit. Just rotate your shoulders. Okay. Just round to... in a circle. Mm -hmm. 
let your bottom yeah. literally move with that saddle. Yeah. It was very emotional. I don't know how much emotion you can get um, across on television. She stayed on Zion's back a lot longer than I expected, and uh, what more? What more could you ask for? I have to say that was really much more emotional than I thought it would be, but I couldn't have done it with anybody else apart from Sir Lee. He is just brilliant, giving me so much confidence and that beautiful, beautiful horse. You are the bestest, bestest boy. Dead proud of uh, Zion and uh, unbelievably proud of Lorraine and very flattered that she chose my home and, and one of my horses to get over this remarkable incident that happened to her. And yeah, just a great day. That was incredible, thank you. I need to give you a hug. So proud of you. Oh, thank you so much and thank you, Zion. I'm not gonna feel frightened anymore. I'm not, I'm not. And that's a huge, huge big deal for me. It really is, yeah. <laughs> Wow, oh gosh, that was a very emotional day. The man I couldn't have done it without, Sir Lee Pearson, joins me now. Oh, and see you on the gorgeous, the two most beautiful people, because <laughs> he's a person. See you on like a person. Mm. Thank you so, so much hey. for helping me. You know I couldn't have done it with anyone else. I'm only going to carry on helping you if you stop calling me Sir Lee and just start <laughs> calling me Just Lee. But, just um, Lee, Just Lee, was, I know. Uh, it was an amazing Just Lee, Just Lee. <laughs> Uh, we've gone beyond the surly now. No, it was an absolutely brilliant day, a very, a very emotional day, as we saw just on the VT. I was, I, I hope that um, well, your fear and your emotion and your strength came over on the on the television, and I think I think we managed that. I think it was, a, it was an amazing day, even if cameras weren't with us. The cameras were a, an, an extra, really, because of who you are. But um, yeah, very, very proud of you. Well, I couldn't have done it without you, and I certainly couldn't have done it without Zion. You got the right. You said to me, "I have got the perfect, perfect horse for you." You know, the the perfect one, um, and of course, he, he absolutely was so gentle and so patient. Just like his dad. <laughs> Just like his dad. They're like dogs, really. They're like the humans. No. I was quite patient, I, I was patient, yeah. but uh, yeah. it wasn't about Zion really, and it wasn't about me, it was about you, and, and you've done that 10 year conquer your fear anniversary. So I think I, I think I have read you're not getting back on again there, though, but we've, we've got to do a pub ride yet. We've got to go to the pub on horseback. You can do that? That sounds, do you know what? I yeah, think maybe, of course. maybe I could do that. I just felt, you know, it was, it was one of maybe. those, yeah, it was one of those things, Lee, that I never thought I would be able to do because, as you know, it was only the second time I'd ever been on a horse when the accident happened. And, you know, yeah. you, it, there was a lot of, I think, unfinished business there. And, like I say, I, I really couldn't have done it without you, but it just shows you that once you overcome your fears, um, I actually felt, so, I mean, I was on a high afterwards. You know, I just, I really felt as if I'd achieved something. Well, I think, I bet you were exhausted on the way home. Yeah. I bet it took you a few days to realise what actually <laughs> happened. Did, did, did you get into trouble with your husband? No, no, he was fine when I came home because I, I didn't tell him. But when I came <laughs> home, he was, he was actually, he was very proud and he said, that's good. And he knew because it was you as well, um, there's that, you know, uh, you, you just okay. know, you just know. But Lee, thank you so, so much. I have to say a massive thank you as well to Caitlin, to William, to Leanne and Daniel, and of course, Zion as well. You, you've got a wonderful, Aww. wonderful place there. It's so warm and, and, and so relaxing and just lovely. Yeah. And I can't wait to see you again very soon. Hope so. Thank you. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you. Oh, for... amazing man, amazing, amazing man. And I do feel better for doing that. It's, it's, it's good to, you know, overcome your fears. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.